Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. In our previous videos, we have seen some sort of animation how you can do it with the help of CSS and HTML. In our today's video, we are gonna see another type of animation where you're going to add a background video and on that you can add your text which you want in your website. And this you can also use it for your front page of your website. So without wasting any time, let's start. As we all know, this is our index.html preceding with our styles.css with the preview tab here. So let's add the HTML snippet. This is the HTML simple snippet that we have. And then we're going to link it with our CSS that is present. Let's save it. Let's style the body. How are you going to style the body? Here in the body, I'm just going to add a section with a class name as a play. And inside this section, we're going to add a video in which is going to play in the background. For the video to add, you have a tag called as the source tag in which you're going to write the address of the video if you're going to take an online video or the location link if you're going to take it from the offline. Now we are going to see it from online itself. So here we have a Pixabay. In this Pixabay, I have just decided this video to add in my program. So how you're going to take it from online? If you want it offline, you just have to click on this video and you just have to download it. If you don't want to download it in your laptop, if you just want to use it from online, you can also use that. You just have to go back and just right click on whatever video you want. Can I see the video address, copy video address? Just click on that copy video address and go back to your source code. In that source code, wherever you have this source, just paste it in there. So your video is ready to play. Now, in order to play that video, all I have is a two, a two or three attributes. Just I'm going to add it here. One is autoplay, autoplay, and this should move infinitely. So to move it infinitely, I'm just going to add loop and then I'll just mute it because I don't want the audio of that and just close our video tag. This is all. Now we can see that the video is being played in our preview tab. Now after that, let me add the title for this video. For the title, I'm just going to give the H1 for this thing and here the class will be title. It is going to be beyond trainer. Beyond trainer is the title here. We'll save this. And what I'll do is I'll just make it in the center. I'll just use the center tag and I'll make the title be in the center. Perfect. We have both. Now let us style this. First, as usual, we're going to start with the body. Margin, 0. Padding, 0. And background, I would like to give it black. Okay. Now, our title is not being visible. It's okay. Fine. We'll do it in the title section. Now, next, we're going to style the section that we have. This section that we have, that is the play section. So, now, in this play section, I want the width to be 100% and height also should be 100%. Perfect. And position for this will be relative. Save this. After doing this, we have dot play and we need to style the video. Now, in order to style the video, width of the video, width of the video should be 100%. Height of the video should also be 100%. The position should be absolute. From the left, it should be zero pixels from the top it should be of about zero pixels that is it should cover complete width of the video and thus let me make it 100 bh all right fine save it next what i'm going to do is you have one property that is object fit to cover so now you can see that the video that we were seeing, it is completely fitted in our preview tab. So it is complete. If you are going to see it in the live server, let us see how it is going to look like. Okay, so this is our preview thing that we have. Now after this, 
I'm just just gonna style the title now. Dot title. Open this. Width of the title will be hundred percent. Height of the title will also be hundred percent. Background color will be black, and the color of the title will be white. So you could see that. Now after that, I'm just gonna add the font size for about two hundred pixels. You can see it, right? And you have one property which is called as a magic property. This is a mix blend mode. Now in this mix blend mode, I'll take it as multiply. Can you see this multiply here? I'll just click on it. Now you can see whatever the whatever we have here, it's been given to us in a proper format. So let us see this. Okay, let's go here and let's open it in the live server. Okay, let's make this hundred percent. Then whatever we were having this overflow that will be gone. Let's open it again in the live server. Open it in the live server. Now you can see that the overflow that was there that's gone. Now let us also change the font family of this. Anything you can create, whichever you want, you can take. I'll just be taking this. Save it. Go back, refresh it. So this is how you can use any font or any text with your video and blend it in one and use as your cover page for any of your websites. So this is all for today's video. Let us meet again in another video with some other animation or some other interesting topics of HTML and CSS. For many such videos, subscribe and hit the bell icon. Till then. Keep learning. Bye-bye.